What's up everybody, it's me, Vintas SGN, coming at you with more Dragon Ball Xenoverse gameplay on a tips and tricks segment that I'd like to call Stamina is a Weapon Using Super Saiyan Vegeta or just regular Vegeta. I know in other videos I've told you that I am on my way to becoming the best Vegeta in the server and I want to be that more than in just words. I want to show you and this is the best way I can show you the progress of becoming the best by showing you what I've learned and teaching you the tips and tricks that I've learned along the way. In this tutorial video, I'll be teaching you three different techniques that I've perfected. One called Teleport Surprise, the second one called Throttle, and the other one called Stay Down. So without further ado, let's get to lesson one, the Teleport Surprise. Alright, the Teleport Surprise is a really sneaky trick. Uh, before you try it, I suggest having at least two to three stamina bars because you can't do the teleport without at least two stamina bars on your gauge. So all you're doing is you get into a melee with somebody, throw a couple of punches, and then hit the X button to teleport behind them, and then hold the L1 if you're on PlayStation, hold the L1 in circle, and that's going to get your grab on. So you just hit, 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 teleport behind, L1 circle, grab, and it's surprise! It's really good to do and it actually works in PvP. I went to this random matchup with these people and I tried it on them. Let's see how it works. When attempting this technique in PvP, you have a better success rate of getting this technique off on someone who's actually targeting you rather than someone who's running away from you. So you definitely want to make sure the person you're doing it against is trying to fight you. Okay, on to lesson two, the get down and stay down. This is another sneaky trick, and you don't really need to have any stamina with this, just a power bar, at least one of your key bars. So basically what you're doing is you grab your target, like so, and then immediately after, big bang. This works with the big bang exclusively because it goes towards your target. The vanishing ball, not the super vanishing ball, but the regular vanishing ball may also work because it actually targets your opponent and goes straight to them. That's what makes this big bang, is this technique so relevant is because once your opponent is helpless, this attack actually seeks them out and destroys them while they're helpless on the ground. It's easy to get off on PvP because when you throw somebody down, a lot of times people are eager to come at you. You hit somebody with the grab, they're eager to maybe grab you back and do it to you. So when they get back up, they have a big bang in their face. And I just finished off the computer there with a the teleport surprise. Alright, so here's the PvP application. Um, same group of guys that I was up against. They didn't want to leave. They were having fun sparring with me, especially this guy, Jumper On. Alright, so there it is. The Bim, got him. See how he ran straight towards me? He had no idea what was coming. He just knew that I threw him away and he wanted to come and get retaliation. And it's easy to just keep throwing at him. Here's one final time. And get down and stay down. Okay, and the final lesson for today is called Throttle. It's really simple to do, and I know that, that when I first started it, I really didn't know exactly how to get into it. I really wished I had someone to teach me exactly what I was doing to make someone go flying. But this is a setup move, and it sets up for further lessons down the road next week of how to really get some combos going. And we're back with our uh, buddies that I was queuing up with, totally random people I don't know. This guy was nice enough just to keep fighting with me and not want to spam. So basically, how do you do this? The throttle. It's a three-hit combo. If you're on the PlayStation 4, it's square-square triangle. And this works great with the teleport surprise in place of the grab. So if you want to fight, teleport, bam, 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 throttle. Simple. Get behind them, teleport. Watch here. Bam, bam, wait, no, he's got me. Teleport. Bam, 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 throttle. This three-hit launch combo sets up for so many other devastating techniques, so many combos that can just last for a while to keep your opponent juggled. I'll share all of these with you on the videos to come. Um, probably next week or the next couple of days, I'll post another video on Vegeta and combos after you guys have pretty much had a chance to watch this video thoroughly, master some of these techniques that I've shown you here. You're interested in that sort of thing. So here's the one of the fights. The... Uh, middle fight that I have with these guys. They were good sports. They didn't spam. They just wanted to box with me and I enjoy that. Thank you, Jumper On. Have no idea who this guy is. He just, I don't know, some random. But I've talked too much. 
uh, I hope you enjoyed the rest of the video. If this video was helpful to you, if you learned something in this video, please hit the like button, share your comments, and subscribe. If you have any questions, feel free to put them in the comment section, ask me, and I'll answer them as best as possible. Until next time, the self-proclaimed master of Vegeta, the best Vegeta on the server, Vent is SG and is out. Peace. Thank you.